Tonight, justice delayed for the family of Arbery Anthony. Two years after the tragic shooting of that eight-year-old little girl, the murder case is delayed. And now the family is wondering when justice will be served. Kelly Turner joining us live in the newsroom. So where does this case stand right now? Yeah, right now, two out of the seven people accused in Arbery's death are out on bond. And as of this week, the case remains on hold, leaving the family in what they call a cycle of hurt. Jamila McDaniel says two years without her niece Arbery is a pain that continues to grow. It's a pain you never want to experience. It's something you'll never go get over. You'll be able to learn how to live with it, but you won't get over it. My heart is, is shattered because she shouldn't be where she's at. She should be here with us. But at the start of this year, she says there was a new hope that the case would go to trial when it made it on the court calendar. But when Judge Wright's gavel hit the desk Monday morning, it moved the case to a future date. Didn't know anything about the continuance, um, like I said, when I talked to you the other day. And now they want to know why. I want to know when, why it's taking so long, why I got to get pushed back, why I got to get continued. Two years? No, it shouldn't take this long. The reason for the pushback? We found attorney Bruce Harvey sent in this notice on December 27th, stating his involvement with the YSL gang case in Atlanta, a jury trial that can take four to six months. And now their family is back to the waiting game. Know what to think, honestly, when they keep pushing it off and keep pushing it off. But we want to make sure she gets served. We want to make sure everybody still remembers her. It's just, it's a very frustrating feeling. Now, Judge Wright also told me that the lead investigator on the case has been deployed for the last year and recently just got back. So the case is not ready for trial. Just a frustrating delay, I know, for those family members who are just ready for some closure here. Hallie, thanks for those updates from court.